Chris and Chapo. I'm going independent to me, this like a mulatto. Heaven needs your right nation, and only shit is the motto. When Jay, your big homie, and the streets got you. You drop a hit, you get too big, and they forget about you. To say they boss it. All right, coming up next, the main event, a matchup for the UFC lightweight division title. Here he is, the number one lightweight contender, making his way to the octagon as the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it, just a few. All right, here he is, the reigning defending undisputed UFC lightweight champ. Sometime, the question is, as the challenges get stiffer, can he remain the hunted? Several championship fights to his credit, a lot of 25 minute wars. And, he, and now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, and they both possess a similar height and reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC lightweight championship of the world. Let's All right, so here he is, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC champion out of the red corner. Many of you remember his title defense not all that long ago. He won it by knockout. And most of the guys, the number one quick level change now. He went single into a high crotch. Oh, he's taking a beautiful ride. Oh, he takes a full ride. What a fantastic takedown. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Cruz. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Back to his feet. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Well placed kick there by Cruz. Yeah, he's hurt really bad. He's got him hurt here. Outstanding output on both sides. And a knee. And they separate. Two minutes have expired in our opening round. Boom! Big jab. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Oh! Massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. A big right hand lands. Oh, Superman punch. Oh, that is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. Well, he works hard to get up again here, but he looks hurt. Oh, wow! Head kick. Wow! And just like that, the fight is over. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're going to get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moment, you got to show up, and that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bugliotta is going to stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 28 seconds of the very first round. Playing the winner by knockout, and... Still, the undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Cruz. Well, for my money, this is the deepest.
this toughest UFC division and the road to lightweight glory still goes through that man's backyard. Congratulations to the champion once again. And he's got a massive fence around that backyard, not letting anybody in. He's not trying to share this title reign. He wants to be the UFC champion for a long time.